Thank you guys for joining Live with Chambers. I think it's August 7th, 2020, and I'm currently in Minnesota with my family due to COVID in Los Angeles. And, um, you know, things you do in Minnesota, you go fishing, don't you know? So I went fishing and I was like, I need this Bassmaster sweatshirt. I need to fish in this. And I caught a walleye at the Canadian border. So it was super exciting. Um, let's see, I don't know if I, this live thing is so confusing. Questions from your viewers show up here. Go live with, okay, I can go live with people. I can add, I don't want to add that, okay. I guess I don't know, I can't put a title on it once I've started streaming. That's okay. But I have a single coming out next Friday called Strong, and I'm super excited to share it with you guys. I haven't played it in a long time, so when I sing and play it for you today, it's gonna be like the first time in a while. Um, but yeah, I thought I would start with a song that's on my Spotify page that you all know. sweatshirt and I'm probably gonna say that like 20 times during this set and you know things you do in Minnesota you go fishing on the lake and you know we went to go buy some worms and I was like I need this in my life I need this for $4.99 <laughs> I was like I have to go fishing in a fishing sweatshirt <gasps> oh my gosh multitasking dad 
Are you serious? You're not watching this live. I'm so freaking out. I was going to DM you today because today I watched our NCIS episode that you did my makeup for and I was freaking out. I was like, I need to DM multitasking dad. I forget your first name. I'm so sorry. But I was watching NCIS and I'm on the episode. It's season 17, the current season, episode 16. So... I was going to say, hey, your episode has aired live, Annie. You can go watch me on NCIS. My makeup artist is watching us live right now. So that's so cool you tuned in because I was thinking of you today. So that's just weird. I'm wearing my lovely T-I-J-N necklaces. I really love this brand. Um, it's high quality. They have really cute packaging. I've had it for a few years. I've used their necklaces for a few years and they don't tarnish. And everything on their site is under $50, so it's very affordable. And I got this sun and moon necklace for a star. I thought of that after I bought it. But no, I'm not joking, I'm serious. So, today, it's gonna be a lot of songs you've heard before because I have been nannying my niece and I have not learned any new pop songs for you guys. But I'm gonna start learning some Motown songs because Lucy is obsessed with Motown. So I was like, I need to learn some fun songs, not like a lot of the songs. I'm like, oh, I can't sing. This is a depressing song for an 11 month old child. I should learn some happier songs. So. This is a good song, but oh, we are not starting this, but I can't sing Lady Gaga, Star is Born as my second song. I haven't sang in a month. That would be, I shouldn't make my face like that because I don't have Botox right now. You'll see all my lines. That would be disastrous. Like, let's just start with the Star is Born as my second song. I don't think so. I'm looking for a specific song though. And I'm not gonna lie, this sweatshirt is hot today. So I am sweating it out for you guys. If we can't find the song, we might just have to do a different one, which is totally fine. I don't think it's happening. Well, we'll do House of the Rising Sun. It's sticky up her. Oh my gosh, you're in Maple Grove? Hello, I need to cut your hair while you're home. Yeah, it's. I feel sticky right now in the ring. I just got a new ring light, which is why I look so flawless. Doesn't it look way better with the ring light? I think it looks way better. We'll sing. House of the Rising Sun. And for everyone, I'm doing this show to promote my new single that's coming out next Friday. It's hard for me to play and talk at the same time. I don't know how Taylor Swift does it. Maybe because she's performed for like the past 15 years, every other day of her life. <laughs> I cannot talk and play at the same time. It's so hard. I can talk, I can play and sing at the same time, but talking is... songs. Okay, I'll stop talking and play. There is a house in New Orleans. They call the rising sun. And it's been the ruin of many a poor boy. And God, I know
like a jazz improv. Yes, it is. <laughs> this next song I wrote recently called Sun Queen, so I hope you guys like it. I have a single coming out on Friday, so in a week from now, so seven days, I have a new song coming out. Cannot wait. Make sure to pre-save it. Um, DM me your email address so I can put you on my mailing list. Believe me, you get like two emails a year, maybe one. I'm not an emailer, so it's just when big important things come out, you're going to get an email. sure you were working. Um, I have a song coming out on next Friday called Strong that I'm very excited about and Connor is here. So I am going to be honest, I have not played this song in a while. Mm -hmm. Like a long time. And naturally I was like, of course I'm gonna get it ready for my show. And I am going to do a private listening party this week on Zoom. So if you DM me your email address, you can be invited to my Zoom to have a pre-listening party, probably on Wednesday or Thursday. So this is called Strong, I wrote it a very long time ago, probably like three years ago. I started it four years ago, and then when we were in the studio, I changed the song a little bit because it used to be called I Pretend to Be So Strong. And then I was like, it's so cheesy, but I'm not pretending anymore. I actually am strong. What am I talking about? I'm not pretending, I am. And Obviously right now with everything that's going on in the world, a breakup is the least of my concerns and a broken heart, although those are very valid feelings. But I, at the end of the song was in the studio and I really wanted a big choir, like to go crazy, like an Alicia Keys clapping, like 
choir sound. Obviously did not have the budget for that, but I wanted it to be less about me and more for other people. So at the end I was like, I wanna sing you are strong and we are strong. And I think that that's important right now as a country and a world to remember that we're stronger together in unity and regardless of what's going on in the world, to pray for the world and try to encourage and listen and love others and be kind. So I was like, I'm gonna dedicate my song Strong, which was written almost five years ago about something else, but I still find the theme of the song to be true for what's going on in today. So here's to not playing strong for like a year. so hard to carry on every time I think I'd be okay it's just the mention of your name I fall apart my broken heart fighting the tears get back to the start it's been a year since you've been gone and that's why I I pretend I pretend to be so strong on Strong comes out next Friday. I hope you guys enjoy it. That was the live performance. Obviously the um, studio is gonna sound different. And let's do, I'm gonna, Hi Mel, um, request Lucy's presence down here before the show is over. So I'm just gonna message my brother-in-law to bring her down. But he doesn't like this song, so I'm gonna sing it first and then I'll message him.
thank you everyone for joining. I hope you like Imagine. Such a pretty song. I love that song. I'm going to request little Lucy's presence for the end of the show. I think I hear them coming. She's coming! Oh my gosh! My little sidekick is coming to join. <gasps> Hi, Lucy! Do you want to come be on my live stream? match today for my live show and we also drew a picture today we wanted to share with everyone you want to show everyone your picture we sorry just put her in the face we drew a pink flower show everyone song. Should we sing Lonely Sea? Give the people what they want. We'll sing Lonely Sea. Okay. <laughs> Lucy likes I want to hold your hand. Julie, do you mind um, finding I want to hold your hand in here? Should be in the beginning. We can sing Lonely Sea until that happens. tuning in with Lisa and Lucy and we have a single coming out I do on next Friday called strong which I'm so excited about and <laughs> so this is fate for your song called I want to hold your hand Oh, please. 
guys miss? I think the connection went out. I didn't know what that's meant. I didn't know that's what the black screen of death meant. Anyways, thank you for joining Lisa and Lucy for Live with Chambers. And make sure to pre-save my single on Spotify called Strong that's coming out next Friday. And I hope you guys enjoy it.